Hey everyone, in this video we're going to talk about epiglottitis, which is a medical emergency. Watch the end. Epiglottitis is inflammation and swelling of the epiglottis. The epiglottis is a flap of tissue that sits beneath the tongue at the back of the throat. Epiglottitis is most common in children 2 to 7 years old and is characterized by high fever, pharyngitis, dyspnea and rapidly progressing upper airway obstruction. It typically manifests in a healthy child but it can be seen in any age who has an abrupt onset of fever and sore throat and then appears toxic with labored breathing, inspiratory strider, and difficulty swallowing within several hours. The child usually drools and keeps the neck hyperextended in an attempt to maintain a patent airway. Here you can tripod position. The classical signs of tripod position are drooling, strider, which is noisy breathing, caused by obstructed airflow, dyspnea, which is shortness of breath, tachypnea, which is rapid breathing, and a child sitting forward assuming the sniffing position in order to maximize the airway. The most common cause of epiglottitis in children in the past was Haemophilus influenza type B, the same bacterium that causes pneumonia, meningitis, infections in the bloodstream. Lateral radiographs of the upper airway may show the thumb sign with a swollen epiglottis as seen in the image. Also, the epiglottis is enlarged and may appear cherry red in color. Epiglottitis is a medical emergency. If not treated quickly, it can be fatal. Maintenance of the airway is the mainstay of treatment of patients with epiglottitis. If your epiglottitis is related to an infection, you will be given IV antibiotics. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and share this video with your friends. Don't forget to watch our folate deficiency science video and see you on the next one.